And often when you're in those things where you have like painted your character into a corner or you've done something crazy, it's literally just having someone ask you a question that you haven't asked yourself. And that then allows all of that other awareness and all of those other possibilities and choices to show up. Well, that's something, I mean, Annalisa would never like toot her own horn, but I will be over here toot tooting all day. But that is something that <laughs> did for me as a writing coach, because, yeah. you know, it's something where I had been working on a project for, for so long and I had these characters and I had this idea, but I just, I hated my characters. They were terrible and they were yeah. flat and I couldn't, but I couldn't for the life of me figure out why. And mm -hmm. in like 20 minutes and her asking me like a series of three or four questions, I think it was, you know, just oh, well, that's why. And she said, you know, this is, yeah. this is why they're not coming off the page and this is how we fix it and this is how we do this. And I think that, you know, working with a writing coach or, you know, a creativity coach like you are, Lisa, you know, makes yeah. a significant difference to your work so that you don't have those moments because writers are so easy to despair. You know, it's so easy to crawl oh, yeah. and cry for days about how it's ruined. All this work you've done is ruined and you're never going to write again and your life is over. You know, getting down in the dumps is so easy. And I think that, you know, having somebody like you, like Annalisa, that you can, you know, send a quick text, a quick email and be like, why is this not working? Help me. Yeah. Makes yeah, yeah. such a significant difference. And I don't understand why everyone doesn't do it. 